This weekend, we set off to the gorgeous Victorian high country. The plan is to head into Jamison, Victoria Friday night. Then Saturday, bright and early, we will head north of Jamison to explore the gorgeous Harker Hills region. We head up Fry's Hut, cruise through Sheepyard's flat campsite, we check out Noonan's Hut, we also walk through relics from the past called Tunnel Bend, which is a 200 metre tunnel built back in 1884, well worth checking out if you're up that way. We run into some jeep troubles, which forces us to change plans a bit, and of course, you'll see some cook-ups and how not to cook bush donuts. Got to clean the windows before you go? Yeah, mate. Can't see out of them. <laughs> Maybe I should clean the car too. <laughs> massive shortcut to get to the property, although you have to cross the river. With all the rain we had at the time, the river was high, so we opted to take the long way in. Looking at the depths of the river, I think we've made the right choice. Nathan's going to give it a burst. Two things fire needs fuel and air, oxygen. Hey, look at that. <laughs> there you get it going. What do you reckon, girls? A bit amazed? Hey? <laughs> Who doesn't love a good old new camping toy? I just had to show it off to my cousins and give them a lesson on fire. What's going on? Uh, trying to route this bloody track. It's the fourth time that app has bugged out on me. But we'll get there. We'll get there. <laughs> Here's a tip for the Android users out there running HEMA. Make sure you lock the rotation of your device. Every time I reach for my drink, the app would crash and I lost my route waypoints. That'll teach me for planning routes the night before. <laughs> and in the meantime, sitting here, enjoying the fire.
Jeep, don't you? Hey, it's a much nicer car. It goes further. Walking down to Fry's Hut, we had to walk past the gate because the gate was closed. Can't drive down here, there's no access due to seasonal closures. Uh, nice big long drop, and then you got old Fry's Hut. Oh, yeah, it's exciting. <laughs> Welcome to my home. <laughs> <laughs> 
How cool is that? Freaking awesome. It's got multiple rooms. So cool. Just went to Fry's Hut down Harkwa Hills region. Beautiful little hut. We're now on our way to check out some other huts down Brock's Road and see what's down there. We'll probably pull up for lunch and then keep tracking around back around to La Colla Road and then back through to Jamison again. So, heading down through Sheepyard Flat at the moment and cut through there and keep tracking on. So we've just had to pull over, check out Noonan's hut. Nice little hut here on the side, right next to the river. How good's that? Beautiful. Unfortunately, Noonan's hut is private, so there is no entering this hut. Decided to pull over and come check out Tunnel Bend. Which way do we go here? Left or right? So we're cruising down Brock, Brock Road. What we've done so far, as you would have seen, we've done Fry's Hut, done Sheepyard Flats, and cruising through now, we went down the tunnel bend, went and checked out the tunnel. Uh, first we just had a peek and then we ran into a couple, um, and they said to go, they walked through it, and then me and Leah decided to go do the same, and we went, Put our, put our shoes on and went and walked through it. It's pretty cool. It was really cold, but it was okay. And, and now we're still cruising down Brock. We're gonna try and get access to Upper Jamison Hut. See what that's like. And then we're gonna try and find camp down near Snake Edward Divide, down near Jamo. Shattered. Unfortunately, due to the lack of planning on my part, track to get into Upper Jamison Hut was shut. Finally made it into camp. So we headed into Wren's camp. Didn't make it into Jamo like we planned because that road was a bit longer than we thought. But now at camp, got the fire going. She's just roaring beautifully. 
was supposed to have it with us and he's kept it all for himself, Marston. <laughs> yeah. Okay, kept it all for yourself. Yeah, exactly. mm. Cinnamon and sugar. Right. Dip them in the batter. Alright. One, two, this is. Alright, now the oil is should be hot enough. We're ready to go. We're gonna put these in here. Alright. Oh wow, they're gonna be ready in an instant. Oil's probably a little bit too hot, but that's alright. <laughs> Probably turn that down just a tad. Hopefully these don't get too burnt. Oh they are, they're gonna get too. <laughs> I know. Huh? Oh, what a fail. <laughs> Failed. They're gonna burn through the face. <laughs> Oh, those ones, yeah. <laughs> That's not how you do it. Put it straight over there. They're quality. <laughs> At an optimal temperature. Ready? Do or die moment. That's better. Alright. Chuck them in. Alright. Rotate those. Let them cook for a bit. <clears throat> so these are ready now. So you take these off the oil and you throw them in some cinnamon sugar. All right, give them a bit of a rotate. Thank you. Throw them in. Give them a bit of a rough around, okay. and that's not all done. Okay. How's that? All right, pretty much. Hang on, there's a big hair on that one. All right, ready? All right, ready to go. See how that goes. Huh? Oh, a bit hot. All right, perfect. Perfect. That's how you do bush donuts in the bush. Jam filling donuts. Or whatever you want. Chuck chocolate in them, jam, Nutella, whatever you need. <laughs> Alright, we're done, let's go eat. All good? Mm-hmm. Chicken approval? Mm-hmm. It's the best. <laughs> <laughs> problems with the uh, Jeep this morning or well, since yesterday it's been going on oh, I don't know we had a bit of an engine light so we'll try the old uh, wise, wise <laughs> theory and disconnect the battery and see what happens I reckon if you leave the battery disconnected for a while <laughs> something might uh, something might work we'll see how we go problem is it's a Jeep that's yeah that's what we're doing <laughs> Making some uh, baked potatoes for brekkie. Baked potatoes for brekkie. Yep. Gonna cut them up. Chuck some sauce in them. Some bacon. Probably chuck an egg in it. There you go. Egg and bacon and potato for brekkie. <laughs> oh yeah. Way to do it. Grab the potato. Dip it in some water. Apparently. Some words of wisdom from Jason. <laughs> so it'll steam up, mate. Make them nice and fluffy. Experience. 
comes from experience. There's a sweep tatter. <laughs> First time. Oops, here we go. Village. <laughs> It's a healthy choice of uh, baked potatoes. <laughs> Ghosts are running around my head. I feel it when I'm sleeping, even when they're dead. Dancing on the stones like all my friends have drank. Get to the top and tell me when you're there. Turn your wheel. Hey, that's it. As much stick I give him about the Jeep, he knows how to put me in my place, that's for sure. First part done.
Oh my god. Last night we decided to camp in Wren's Flat campground, a uh, nice little spot there. Decided to cancel going into Snake Edward Divide just because it was a bit further than our liking. So we clipped into firewood last night and headed back into the camp. Um, and then woke up, had, had a bit of a sleep in this morning because Jason had a couple issues with the Jeep. Um, the engine light was coming on and wouldn't go over 3,000 revs or something like that. So we decided to take it easy today and not go down. We are planning to go down Mount Terrible, um, probably Moonlight Spur, but I thought with the issues we're having, we better not, better not do that. Um, we just took Mount Sunday Road and come back down to now um, Jamison La Cola Road. Heading back into Jamo and then we'll cruise home from there. Goes down, driving light in the heart, counting trees around. This is our day to dream. My heart, it's cost with you. Just heading back home. The old lights are a bit. There you go. Bit of a Might as well not stop there, mate. Might as well do the whole car. <laughs> do the right thing, mate. That way we don't get pulled over. No hassles. Beautiful. 
Pity you can't polish a turd, eh? <laughs> hey, it's the best looking turd you'll ever see. <laughs> Let's go.